In this video tutorial, I'll be showing you a pretty cool Facebook desktop application that you can use to serve Facebook without having to actually open it up or internet web browser such as Google Chrome or Mozilla Firefox. The reason I like to do this is mainly because of the UI and because it's just a whole lot faster because it doesn't load up any other scripts or anything. It just loads up like a regular program and it's blazing fast for me. So thank you for watching my video. Don't forget to subscribe. The desktop application of Facebook that is by Telerik is called Telerik FDEC. Now what this is, Telerik is, is a company or a service that allows you to make great apps using great UIs that they um, have allowed you to use or that you can personally make up. They offer leading UI suites for all .NET platforms and actually they offer it for more than just one. As you see right here, you can also have Windows Phone, um, WinForms, Reporting, dot, um, AS, ASP.NET, Silverlight, and ASP.NET Ajax. And basically, what they actually have is a, um, this client right here. So what you do is you press Install, and it's actually going to install Microsoft Silverlight for you. And after that, um, either a .exe file or a .air file comes up to you. And a .exe file is very, is a regular installer, and a .air file is a regular installer that was made using Adobe Air. So keep that in mind. Either way, um, if, they, if it's that .air file, then it's gonna go pretty quick because for me it took me less than thirty seconds to set this system up. And if it's a I mean, if it's a .exe file, maybe you take it may take you like a minute or two. Um, still quick, pretty quick though. And I, I actually already have my um, Telerik FDEC um, UI, uh, I mean desktop application all laid out. And again, I said it has a great UI and it does. Um, as you can see, like I can even go over here to photos um, because it has some things, some of the latest things that, um, that you've been checking out and stuff. For example, this one is a McAfee. I clicked the like button on McAfee and now it has some random McAfee stuff on here. It's not not all of it's McAfee, and so yeah. Anyway, you can see this UI that lights up. It even has um, it has home people photos, events, inboxes, inbox, and notification. It has uh, the what's on your mind thing, so you can write stuff down right here. You can even put a URL or a photo. It can even access your webcam if you have a webcam on your on your system. You can go from, oh yeah, in each one of these, for example, um, I think, for example, people. Uh, yeah, on people, like on most of these, they have a little sidebar right here. Most of them have a sidebar, like right here, I can see all my photos that are recently uploaded. And uh, I think even Inbox has them. Yeah, I may be wrong. Oh, yeah, it does. It's right here. And yeah, on both sides again. So it's kind of a pretty cool UI that you can have on whoever you switch pages. Um, you cannot like open applications using this. Actually, you can, but it's gonna take you to an actual internet web browser, and that's okay too. I mean, this wasn't built to run every single thing. So um, anyway, that's all for now. Thanks for watching my video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more videos. And also, if you would like any, um, if you would like to see any other videos that I, that you would like me to do a video tutorial on, or tell you about it, then please write down there in the comment in the comment section below. And peace out.